The vision of Cornerstone started about eight years after I had been practicing as a doula myself. And I had started taking on newer doulas as shadows and they were attending births with me, uh, as well as with Julie. And what we were noticing from these new doulas was that they were not equipped for being present in the birth space. They were focusing really strongly on their tools and they weren't tuning in with their clients and they were scared. The vision for Cornerstone started about eight years into my apprenticeship and midwifery practice and doula practice where we were seeing other doulas in the community come in and not really having a foundation of understanding birth on a deeper level like we had and be effective because all they knew was hospital birth because they're two completely different paradigms. They really hadn't had a chance to be mentored and we knew from our experience that we felt when we came in as doulas that there was a lot lacking in our training as well. We know that this is not okay for bringing into the birth space. So they weren't really creating positive outcomes. In fact, we felt maybe they were doing a little bit more harm than good from being present. So sitting with that and thinking about what little I had when I started and how I learned everything I knew about being a doula from trial and error without a community to hold me. And these new doulas coming in and having that same experience, we decided that something needed to be done. And we had years of experience behind us and it was time to do it differently. And it was time to equip new doulas with the tools that they needed to be successful, but also to really show up for their clients and support them in the way that they needed to be shown up for. We wanted to help people get a full vision and a full training and fill in the gaps of what wasn't being offered. There was an aha moment about the time that in that time period. Nikki and I were very interested in it and one of our um, places that we did a lot of research and study was in pre-perinatal and birth psychology. And we found that that was really missing from any of the doula trainings that we could see. We were learning something very exciting about birth, about the experience of the baby through pregnancy, birth, immediate postpartum and beyond, um, about the sequence after birth that wasn't being taught, the first two hours after birth, about the bonding process. And uh, we wanted to incorporate that into a doula training. It's always interesting when we find our calling, right? Like, what was that moment that said, this is actually my path, this is my purpose, this is where I need to be putting my energy into each and every day. And for me, that started at age 10, um, supporting my mom through the birth of my sister. I think for me at that time, I was a growing girl. So I had curiosity regarding my femininity, the process of change, that rite of passage from girl into womanhood. For me, that was a very transformative life experience. I got to see my mom's power as a woman um, bringing forth life into this world, and it really changed my perspective on a woman's role in society and really truly understanding the realness of birth. Cornerstone's core beliefs are actually derived in the name of our training. Cornerstone means foundation, and you need a strong foundation of understanding about the process of birth and how birth affects the world before you can step into this role. And our core beliefs sur are surrounded by trust, respect, autonomy, and honor in the birth process. And every person, every birthing person, deserves to be respected, heard, and autonomous in their birthing experience so that they can come out of it feeling empowered, strong, and bonded with their new baby, their family, and their community. The cornerstone core beliefs are that all people, all birthing people have the right to birth through their body, you know, by their choice, in any location they choose, for it to be a respectful um, environment, for their voices to be heard and acknowledged, for them to have access to a quality of care. 
right? And for us to see the whole person. So we don't just say it's just for women, right? We are mindful to be inclusive in our language, in our information that we share, that birthing is a right for all people. Well, the Cornerstone dream, to be putting it right out there, I would love in my lifetime to see systems of oppression toppled through birth work. And the ideal of Cornerstone is to give access to all communities, to this vital work that we're doing, to be able to reduce health disparities and to um, change the maternal health crisis that we have happening in the U.S. right now. Our vision and the way that we're defining the profession through Cornerstone and our doulas is that we want to get in there and really make a difference in maternal health care overall, the outcomes of people giving birth, their babies, and their families. So sometimes people ask me personally, like, what's your political stance? And I'm like, to heal humanity starting at birth. For us, that is really how we see humanity be being changed, is to do the work from birth. But of course we know it starts way before actual Labor Day, you know, so that's us being active participants in the whole system of healthcare for this society. Within that, we can break down the system of fear, which actually is a system of oppression, about the way our bodies work, get pregnant, give birth, and take care of our families afterwards. It's such a fundamental part of who we are and the wisdom and the knowingness and the trust in our bodies has been lost generation after generation and we've just simply forgotten. We just need to be reminded. We see more and more people being informed of their power, right, of their choices, of their resources. So they don't need to know us personally, but they need to know that there are change agents out there who are committed to humanity just being better.